<laughs> hey there, champ. Uh, what are you What are you doing? Well, these. Well, I'm about to cut this onion, and they always make me cry, and it stings a little. I don't want it to. Well, I, I see the onion, but the. Yeah, goggles. Oh. But you see how they've got holes. Yeah. So that's not gonna help you. What? Don't worry. I can teach you how to cut onion, tear-free, no goggles. It's science. All right. Teach me the science of onions. When you cut into this, you're cutting through a solid, and as we learned when we were trying to write with invisible ink, there's definitely liquid in there, but Onions also have a gas, and when you cut into it, that gas is released. So the gas that's released is called propanethiol S oxide. And it reacts with some enzymes inside the onion and create kind of a sulfur gas. Now, onions grow underground, and the gas that's in these onions actually help deter uh, animals that are under the ground from eating them. So it's a protection measure, right? Your eyes also have protection measures. So when they start to sense something that could be um, dangerous or harmful to your eyes, they start to generate tears as a protection measure. So the onion's really just trying to protect itself at the same time that your eyes are just trying to protect you. So. It's possible that the holes in these goggles, that gas, would still be able to get through. So what can you do about it? There are a couple of ways that you can try to reduce the crying while you cut onion. One of them is to chill your onion before you cut it. If you put it in the refrigerator or the freezer, um, it'll freeze those enzymes and then they won't mix and cause that sort of sulfur gas to come out. Another option is to actually cut your onion under running water or in a bowl of water because the water is going to dilute the gas that comes out of the onion. So next time you or your parents need to cut some onions, maybe try one of those things and let us know how it goes.